mostly because of the bad dream. And why? Do you want to know? Okay, let's take a look at the story after this. The Dream Below by Lutfia Kamish, Nadine Creel, and Nadia Davids. The Dream Below When the stars are out and the moon swings in the sky and the light in my room is slow, things are different. The pirate puppet waves his sword. The mango tree bends its branches. Even my teddy becomes a different sort of bear. I keep very still in my cave of blankets or I call, Mama! Daddy! Or I jump into their bed. I tell Mama about the pirate, the tree, and the bear. You have a really bad dream. What's a dream? When we sleep, we think about our day, but everything gets mixed up. It feels real, but it's not real. But it is real! You know, when we read a story together, it's made up. But we laugh or get scared or excited, right? So, a dream is the same. You mean a dream is a story? Yes. But it happens at night. You put your head on the pillow, you fall asleep, and then the story happens. So, a dream is a story you find in your pillow? Yes, my dear. Can I put the stories in my pillow? You can. How? Hmm, let's write down all your best stories. Fold up the paper and tuck it inside the pillow. When the stars are out and the moon swings in the sky and the light in my room is low, things are different. How was the story everyone? Did you enjoy it? Did you find it interesting? I hope you do. Back to the story again. So the girl couldn't fall asleep because of her bad dream, but then her mom told her that it's okay. Everything because everything was not real. It's only in her dream. It's only in her mind. But we can conclude that a dream is a story that we have when we fall asleep. Okay, but everything is not real. Have you ever getting a bad dream? I have. And it was a scary dream. But then when I wake up, everything I know everything is it's not real. It's gone. Yeah, and then the moral of the story is you have to pray before you fall asleep. Okay? Don't forget that. Okay, see you next week on the next story. Bye bye!